Austin is known for being a pretty liberal city, but recently the police there have gotten in trouble for some really brutal, like, jackboot tactics. Oh, there was yeah. a girl who was jogging across, uh, right next to the campus, actually, on a street that I used to walk down all the time, and uh, she was eventually stopped because they were trying to give people jaywalking tickets. Uh, and she didn't have her ID, and it led to this massive altercation that has had a very big uh, and bad uh, repercussions for the police department there. We got a little bit of video, let's watch. I saw you. What happened? They're giving tickets for people jaywalking, so I wouldn't cross until you see the little white man over there. And while running, <laughs> odd enough. Yeah, and so she, you saw her on the ground there being dragged into the, like, it, it's just, it, it's pretty horrible. She apparently was crying out, I did not do anything wrong, just give me the ticket. And they wouldn't just give her the ticket. Yeah. It's pretty brutal. The other thing, too, like, that I was reading in the article was that she was wearing headphones and she was, like, really focused on her running. Mm -hmm. So she didn't even realize what was happening. And the guy grabs happening. her. Yeah, he just, like, grabs her out and over. I would yeah. freak out, too, if somebody did that to me. Yeah. Like, and even if it's a cop. A cop isn't supposed to just grab you as no. you're running by. And look, like I, I know what those roads around UT, uh, the, the campus is like. People are walk like it's crowds constantly walking and jogging. Jaywalking tickets? I have to imagine they're doing this because they've got some just kind of huge budget deficit that they're trying to close or something like that. Uh -huh. But seriously, jaywalking? That's really a thing? That's like those archaic laws in like Alabama where you can't marry your mule on Sunday or something. It's like technically illegal, but you've got to back off. <laughs> yeah, you have to let people use their own common sense. Yeah, if they want to marry their mule, let them. <laughs> um, but so it went even farther than just the girl being dragged around in this viral video being produced that makes them look terrible. The police chief eventually was quoted as saying something along the lines of, well, look, I know it looks bad and everything, but there are police uh, officers around the country who were sexually abusing people, so at least that didn't happen. <laughs> like, those aren't his exact words, but he did say, like, basically that you're lucky you didn't get raped by that cop. Because I could have done something much exactly. worse to you. There's still time. But yeah, like, like that's the bar that you set for campus police? Like, there... College campuses tend to be the areas in cities where a higher percentage chance you have of getting like sexually assaulted, mugged, and things like that. It tends to coalesce around college campuses. And you're going to have cops who are stopping people for stupid things like jaywalking when there's real crime just to the west of there in West Campus, which is a shithole. And then you're going to go and say, like, you're lucky you didn't get sexually assaulted when nationwide lots of colleges are having big problems with the administration of the colleges and the police departments not doing enough about sexual assault. This is like the worst possible thing you could do for the PR of UT Austin. And it's a great school to go to, but it doesn't need this.